With WWDC 2025 just around the corner, Apple is gearing up to unveil a series of exciting updates across its platforms. Among them, watchOS 26 is poised to deliver one of the most requested features for the Apple Watch, third-party widgets in Control Center. For the first time ever, the Apple Watch Control Center will break free from Apple-only toggles and tiles, opening its doors to widgets developed by third-party apps. This means users will be able to access key actions and relevant data from their favorite apps directly within Control Center, alongside essentials like Wi-Fi, battery, and focus mode. Even better, the Control Center will be fully customizable through the Watch app on iPhone. Users can easily add, remove, or rearrange widgets with just a few taps, making the experience far more intuitive than the current on-watch method. This long-overdue upgrade brings fresh versatility to an area of WatchOS that hasn't seen much change in years, opening up endless possibilities, from quick hydration logging to locking your smart home doors or launching a workout with a single tap. Of course, Apple could tweak or delay this feature before its official release, but the potential here is undeniable. Beyond WatchOS, Apple is expected to reveal major updates across iOS 26, macOS 26, and iPadOS 26, focusing on design refreshes and long-awaited improvements like enhanced window management on the iPad. The WWDC 2025 keynote kicks off on Monday, June 9. For full coverage before, during, and after the event, stay tuned to 9to5Mac. If you enjoyed this update, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated on all the latest Apple news.